good amateur. Went to the World Youth European Games, got a bronze at the European Under 22s in 2021. I was at that tournament. And Rosetta Deli Abruzzi. Ahora recibimos en la esquina dorada al ex contendiente mundial de Las Palmas, Canarias, España, Samuel Carmona. Samuel Carmona, very, very experienced fighter, 12 and 1 as a professional. That one defeat coming in a world title fight to Conjulio Cesar Martinez for his WBC flyweight title in Arizona. Late 2022, lost by majority decision. As an amateur boxed at the Olympics in Rio, got to the quarterfinals. European Championship bronze medalist, boxed at the World Championships, WSB, pretty much did it all. Damas y caballeros, quinta pelea de la noche de campeones. Categoría Gallo, 54 kilogramos a 8 asaltos. En la esquina negra, con un récord invicto de 4 victorias. De Unedo Ara, Rumania, Kosbin Gür Lanu. En la esquina dorada, con un récord de 12 victorias, 5 de ellas por knockout y una derrota. Ex olímpico y ex contendiente mundial de Las Palmas, Canarias, España, Samuel Carmona. Personal técnico para esta pelea fue el número uno. Emerson Pastor de Guatemala, juez número 2, José Romero Hernández de España, juez número 3, Luca Badilonga de Italia, referee Verónica Sux de Hungría. So there's a tail of the tape, not much between the pair of them. Carmona a few years older and with that comes a lot of experience. Carmona in the white in the orthodox stance, Gilianu in the black boxing out of the south four stands. Carmona, naturally the bigger of the two, you can see that quite clearly when you see them up there in the ring. Good work to the body there from Giuliano. It's a nice jab from Carmona. Nice busy start from Cosman Giuliano. He's up against it here, he'll know that. And he's looking nice and confident.
Arsenal just on the outside at the minute. Steps in there and goes to the body with the right hand. Forearms just doing a good job of protecting Carmona there. Too much has been landed clean in this opening round. Just out of range there slightly, Carmona. That right hand, if it did land, barely landed. That was a good angle to see it from. Through that one two, but it was right at the end of its range. into the second round. Good jab there from Gilianu. Shoots it out nice and quick, brings it back quick. He's on Gilianu. He's got the reach on him, I would say, as well. Nice right hand into the body there from Carmona, but a good uppercut from Gilianu. Again, switching Southpaw briefly there. He's taking the centre of the ring for the most part so far. He's the one who's looking for Carmona. Carmona trying to step into a lead left uppercut there. Hence maybe just came together on the inside. jab there from Carmona final minute of round two Carmona looks to try and land with that left hook he's up the punch output in this second round Carmona I would say but Giliano has done well again
Closes the gap there and lands to the body. Left hand was now, but I like to see that from the younger man. The less experienced man, he wants Carmona to hold his feet and have more of a fight. Handed to the body was a good shot. Into the third, they scheduled for eight. And again, it's Giliano who's just planned this peak a little bit wider. with a jab, just trying to cover off that movement of the Spaniard, which is not an easy thing to do, but catches him with a right there as Carmona just looked to try and skirt along the ropes away to his left-hand side. He's looking at the referee there, Carmona, I'm not quite sure why. Giuliano miss. Just beginning to pick his punches a bit better here. The Spanish fighter. To say that he's well short with a lead left uppercut. Come out there, I think. Right hand into the body from Carmona, but the right hand comes back there from Giuliano. The frustrating thing about Carmona is he picks those single punches sometimes. Good example there, nice one too, and then just pulls those feet back out straight away, rather than just stay in there and throw another combination to what you would traditionally see in the pros, in that fighters look to land those punches, obvious punches, like he did there, left of the body, everyone could see that, and then stepped off and found some space. You don't want to stay in there too long and give your opponent the opportunity to answer back. That's still the ethos, really. Giuliani would love Carmona to stay in front of him and just mix it up a little bit more, but he's not going to oblige him. And that's good for Giuliani. Carmona recovered up well, but he just let those hands go, and then he did stay. Stayed in the pocket and went again. Low blow called by the referee.
closing stages of round four, so nearly at the halfway. Into the second half of this one, scheduled for eight in the bantamweight division. Samuel Carmona in the white, Cosman Giuliani in the black. Only has found it difficult to catch Carmona clean most of what he's aimed as land on gloves, forearms, shoulders a lot of the time. And takes one on the gloves there, Carmona, and then just delivers a long right hand into the body. Just making use of the jab there, Gilianu. And the pair of them just swapping right hands. He's such a good mover, Carbona. A very, very elusive target. A difficult man to pin down, and he is pretty accurate with those singles that he throws. difficulty he's got is a left hand there again just lands from Carmona not completely clean right hand into the body is that although he's not being hurt with any of these punches he is being tagged by Carmona and he is continuing to find it difficult to to pin him down because he is just not going to stay in front of you for any length of time and when he is like he is there he's got that guard in place and it's difficult to get anything through he's an effective fighter Samuel Carmona square he's got his shoulder square at least anyway a bit of tape again I think just trailing from the the wrist you see a little bit of damage up by the corner of the right eye there of Gilead Uxing there from Carmona hooked off the jab and then just slid away.
Damas y caballeros, ese es el veredicto de los jueces en esta quinta pelea de la noche de campeones, categoría Gallo 54 kilogramos. El vencedor por decisión unánime, 3-0. La esquina dorada de las palmas, Canarias, España. Samuel Carremona. And not the unanimous decision. And it goes the way of Carmona. A good display from him, a good display though from the pair of them. Carmona just holding the ropes open here for... Cosmin Gilianu, who, as I said, gave a good account of himself on the big, big stage.